Okay, looks like we're down to the last guy here. Uh, these are goblins, by the way. And for defeating them all, we receive an axe. Very nice new weapon. And as you might expect, it is a slash weapon. Uh, much like the scythe and the sword. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and put it on. Let's see its attack. Uh, One-handed, left-handed. Is it always left-handed? Nope, not always. Oh, crap, skeletons. <laughs> this guy here, there was another new enemy there, but I was too scared to fight him. Alright, let's step on this here. A distant noise. While I'm continuing to run on the same thing. <laughs> okay, so then, uh, let's, uh, yeah, I can take these guys on. Okay, I believe that is the last of them. The axe is incredibly effective against those cobras. Let me back up. I want up. Damn you, do I have to do it here? Okay, yes. Have to do it that way. Oh, nope, there's one left. Like I said, uh, axe super duper effective. Just two hits on those guys. Better than the flail was doing. And I don't even have uh, the axe leveled up just yet. Get another presto veggie, which is very useful against all that poison. <laughs> oh, God, the poison. All right, let's head down here. And it looks like something has indeed changed down here. Uh, now we can head down here. Step on a switch to step on this switch. <laughs> and now we can head back and grab... An elephant tusk out of there. Another elephant tusk. I should probably start upgrading some equipment, but I am I am happy with the equipment that I have uh, right now, and I haven't really made a choice about which um, weapon I want to use later on. More snakes. Even cobras. Cobras everywhere. Axe up. As you might... Three hits. Does this guy... Oh, no. He is not weak to axe. No. God. This place is huge. <laughs> Damn this maze. Is there anything down here? Okay, no. So, we need to take on this cockatrice. Let's do that real fast. In order to do that, though, we need to bust out the flail. Since cockatrice are weak to uh, flail and uh, to bow. Damn it. There we go. They're weak to jab. You jab a cockatrice, apparently. But stay away. Don't stone me. Stone would be bad. It pretty much paralyzes you for a little while. You, you do automatically get out of it, but still, that is not nice. Not nice at all. It's not an instant death like it is in other games. Flat seed. Very nice. Kind of. I guess. It's a seed. What are you going to do? So let's head north here. Is there anything to do around here? It doesn't look like it. I don't want to go into the scary cave, though. I don't. Let's head up here face the right way, and we can grab ourselves a red moon horn. Very nice. Let's look at that accessory. What do we got? Red moon horn increases intelligence by 10. Not what I want at all. Not even if I was taking on the skeletons. Well, maybe if I was taking on the skeletons. Uh, up here, we do have a st stone seal that I don't want to get... Damn it. <laughs> I don't want to get too close to because we don't have the seal to break it just yet. So, now we have to go into this cave here. It's really our only option. Still in the dune maze. Alright, let's take on... You know what? This is a, uh, well, plot-related one. So, let's go ahead and fight this on screen. Plus, I got a level up, which is very, very nice. So now I can reveal what my build is going to be. For those of you that have played the game probably already know what I'm going for. But, for defeating those cockatrices... We have saved Jin! You saved me! I was attacked by a cockatrice and tur was turned into a stone for so many years. Stuck as a stone! You're a savior! How can I repay you? Take me with you! Like I'm gonna say no. Come with me! Thanks so much! I'll make you proud. You'll be surprised. And we've received Jin, a wind spirit. But we also gotta level up. I do want to equip... Uh, Jin right away. Um, because, well, he's pretty much required later on. <laughs> uh, so, uh, what I want to do here is actually put the remain. I want to put five points into Magician, believe it or not. Uh, so let's go ahead and put some points in there. Sh yeah, it still affects agility. Nice. 
Yes, we want to put uh, five points into Magician. And after that, I should uh, should get what I want. Let's head north up here. Deeper into the Dune Maze. And we can step on the switch, which doesn't do anything in this room, but it should open up something somewhere. Let me take these guys on. Okay, those guys are gone. I did put the Nux back on, not because they're good against the Cobras, but they are useful here for for what I need to do. I still have uh, Jin equipped, as you might expect. Uh, damn it! Go Jin! Damn it! Go Jin! Can I do it from here then? Go Jin! Go. Jin, you are not working out well for me. Okay, let's go for the bow then. I thought I could reach him from here. There right, go. There we go. Bow is always best <laughs> for that kind of stuff. Let's go ahead and put the flail back on because I love the way that the flail works. And if we head up north here, we're back into another cave. Well, nice. It's got a statue. Seems to be two ways that we can go here. Nope. The up here is a treasure chest with an animal bone. So, I do need to use the goddess statue here, and I'll be right back. Okay, I did save once more. Uh, I did give Amanda an angel grail. Why not? Why not? She's been gone for too long. She's not very useful, but you, know, you, you, you give and you take, really. We do have a couple of enemies here. Once again, she's more annoying than anything else. She t takes all my hits and then I can't do my massive amounts of damage that I want to do. Did I drop anything? No. So let's just head out of here. And here we can find Niccolo again, which is always uh, appreciated even though I'm not going to buy anything from him. Now, I should be able to grab this treasure chest and get another angel grail. Very, very nice. Is there anything else here? doesn't look like it, so let's head south out of here. And down here, it's starting to become night again. Uh, I saw that chest spawn, therefore I know that it is a poultry chest. There we go, he has been lured out. So I need to equip the Nux for this. Let's go ahead and charge up a death blow. Let's see if I can time this right. This is going to be tough with the sand. There we go, 52. See, when I'm hitting him, it's canceled out by your attacks. Do you see that, Amanda? You are not helping. You are actually making things harder for me. Damn it. Oh, dear. God. Why you turned me into a tiny man? All right, we need to use a Stardust Herb in order to cure that. Uh, nom, nom, nom. Now punch him and kick him. All that good stuff. And this is another poker <laughs> chest. Why? Why can't you just be a normal chest? Is there anything over here? Another polter chest. There we go. See, without Amanda here, it becomes a lot easier. And he did actually spawn a real chest, which probably means he was the last one. Oh, you dick. I grabbed that. I grabbed that. Which probably means that this one here is an actual chest. Grand steel. Very nice. So unfortunately, I wasn't able to get with that polter chest spawned because it faded away. But we can head down here and take on uh, these guys. Let me take care of these off screen. Okay, let us grab a couple treasure chests that are here, which are a small seed and an oblong seed. Yeah, just seeds. So let's head back up here because I don't want to go into um, that uh, cave just yet because it is still night and night would be bad so let's make it day or at least morning uh, it is definitely day uh, let's avoid all these guys this time I already took you guys on now we can head into the cave and here we are still in the dune maze do you see why this place is known as a maze uh, just the one guy spawned it looks like uh, the uh, yeah, this uh, mecha caterpillar type thing uh, where I had to have to hit with the Nux. Damn it! No! What do I have on? Oh, that is not what I wanted to have on, actually. Let's go ahead and put uh, Wisp back on so that I can heal. 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 Uh, yeah, just... Uh, 
Everybody has their own little status effects. Actually, we have not looked at uh, the note that Jin would give us. God, this guy is tough. <laughs> this guy is tough. No, 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 I'm not letting you kill me. <laughs> I'm not letting you kill me. See what I mean by underleveled? Oh, God, he attacks so fast. And he just rolls, and he just, like, automatically hits me. What the hell, this guy? This guy? Oh, fuck you. Die. Give me whatever I have earned here. I have rightfully earned it. Anything other than more damage. Oh, that was almost a poltergeist there. <laughs> and we get a long seed for that. Hooray for long seeds. Now we can go over here and step on this. I'm just going to run away from that for now. Yeah, you can fight it if you want. Uh, actually, let's look at Popoy's notebook because I forgot to earlier. Uh, we do have a new memo, of course, because we do have a new uh, spirit, which would be wind. Speed up, that increases speed and agility. Jin inflicts wind damage. And sometimes causes numb status. Very nice status, numb status. Okay, let's put the flail back on. It starts to get a little tedious going through all the menus, to be honest with you. Are you kidding me? You're not giving me a choice here. I have to fight my way out. I just wanted to run. I just wanted to run. Was that asking too much? And she died again. Freaking Amanda died again. What the hell? You had one job. One job. It was to live. And you failed. You failed at it. So let's head back up here. God. <laughs> oh, man. She can't last. She can't last. Now that should have opened up this right here. Let's go in there. And we have made it to the altar of time. We do have a couple treasure chests here with a marble and a chocolate lump. And we also have a gold goddess statue. Very, very nice. I will be using that because I think we all know what this means.